have digital wellness june 21st we celebrated international yoga day and at digital wellness we continued the celebration by covering a number of episodes on yoga and benefits of yoga in today's episode i am happy to be in conversation with edward raj who is a senior banker and he has adopted yoga as way of life let us hear from him about this journey welcome to my channel edward yeah. it's great having you on my channel uh firstly uh, amidst your very busy life what was your motivation to adopt yoga as your way of life good evening sujatha thanks for the time that you have given me and uh, i'm happy to be on this platform to discuss about uh, my experience in yoga uh, the main motivation for me to get into yoga was keep my wife okay and to sumita acharya ji okay my wife has been practicing yoga for last 10 years now and always i used to give it a thought that i should get into yoga but it was you know getting delayed i don't know for what uh, i'm on and uh, even uh, dr sumita acharya when i used to talk to her or meet her she every time used to ask me when are you joining it was when are you joining i i i there will be a time when you're going to join i'm sure this was she said she used to say and uh, i used to, i also used to i used to tell her yes there will be a time but you know not now uh so and uh, knowing uh, dr sunita jain she is a uh, great uh, woman of uh, lady of passion i am in patience and passion about her yoga so and uh, my wife regular practice has you know driven me into this uh, yoga and this started the uh, uh, my journey with of yoga started uh, in the first week of may she was having a discussion uh, with my wife dr sunita jain was having a discussion with my wife about my wife was this that that is my sister was joining and i jumped in said and and i told her that i'm going to join yoga for, uh, in this particular session that you are starting i was really happy and glad that uh, you know i have taken a decision after so many years it's almost a decade uh, that i it, it took for me to uh, join this yoga so to so decide to join this yoga and i said i'm going to start and i'm going to be a uh, with a regular student uh, like my wife is what i gave uh, uh, dr sunita acharya my commitment and i am keeping up to that till now i uh, started the journey on may 3rd and it's been almost uh, two months now and it's been a great experience i found so much of energy so much of uh, you know drive to do this yoga i feel so uh, happy that I have made a right decision in my life. This is one of the best decisions in my life that I have taken. I used to I used to do cycling. I used to do uh, walking as a part of my health regime. But you know, the kind of satisfaction which I get, which I got in yoga, which I am getting in yoga, is really, uh, it, I I don't have words to explain it. Out of the world. And uh, when I uh, started this. I I was sure I'm going to get benefit a lot of this, and the testimony that I I, I wish to share on the, uh, on this platform is I I was diabetic. I've been labeled diabetic for 20 years now, and uh, you know there was not whatever form of exercise I took was not giving me results at all. And uh, in the span of less than two months, I would say I I would give a precise data in April. I checked my sugar level. I did I do a one to three months. In April it was 250 before cold and 327 post prandial. Alarmingly high. I checked last Monday. Okay, it was 104 before cold and 153 after cold. Amazing! I was really shocked. I was uh, seeing the results of the effort. That I made, and this is only because of yoga is it happening. Okay, I I thank my Guruji for you know driving this into me and you know giving uh, walking me through this journey, beautiful journey it is. I'm really enjoying it, and I'm sure I'm going to continue this for life. This is a great, wonderful experience. It it gives me a wholesome fullness uh, for my health. 
mind, soul, and body. It's taking care of all this. And uh, I feel I'm a really changed person after having started yoga. My friends, you know, sometimes they talk. Okay, I just don't ignore. Okay, they say you have become a yogi. You have become a person. You have gone into the state of nirvana because. Uh, I'm uh, I'm basically very naughty guy, but uh, I see a lot of you know changes in me. I have become calm, composed, more you know uh, uh, softer. Uh, even in my office, people say that I have I have changed a lot. So this you know this has given me so much transformation in my life, which I'm happy about, and uh, I'm sure this is going to continue uh, for days to come. You know. Uh... This is a very nice positive uh, experience that uh, uh, you know we've heard uh, from uh, you know especially about how you've adopted yoga and have seen real benefit in terms of transformation. Um, just doing the asanas and pranayamas got you to this transformation, Edward, or did you combine that with uh, you know diet or any other uh, factors? Uh, yes. Good point. Uh, I, I, this yoga, you know, along with the exercise, the pranayama session, the breathing exercises, and all this, uh, along with all this, also the diet is very, very important for uh, for this transformation. Okay, so a major diet. I used to be. I, I'm a foodie. Okay, so I, I used to, you know, uh, hog food, and now I, I ration it into my system. Okay. So it has given me, uh, you know, good results because exercise combined with diet was a, is a great experience, and I'm sure uh, this uh, change in my diabetes level has attributed to uh, the food and the exercise has attributed to this, and it's really you know a wonderful thing that I'm enjoying right now. You know, uh, it is very good to hear that uh, you know. Uh, lifestyle transformation you know which is a combination of diet as well as um, you know the asanas and the pranayamas of yoga has given you that great benefit because uh, what you were talking about and you know an unimaginable uh, change even in your uh, fasting blood sugars and the postprandial blood sugars is, is, is definitely a testimony um, you know then my question to you is how do you plan to sustain this, uh, Edward? Because you also said that there's a big transformation in yourself, right? Uh, in terms of, um, you know, it's brought in a lot of calm to your thinking. Now, uh, what is your plans for sustaining this? And do, how do you plan to actually take it forward, uh, Edward? See, uh, for anything and everything, discipline is the most important thing that is required in life. Okay. And with discipline, you get consistency. So when I when uh, when we bring in discipline within ourselves, okay, it solves 99 percent of the problems. Right? Okay. So what I'm uh, what this, this is my discipline towards this, this way of life, which is yoga, is going to walk me through a long way, and you know to sustain my good health, okay, and to keep myself composed. So consistency is the name of the game. Which starts with this. So that's what is my, uh, you know, uh, mantra which I'm going to follow. Uh, discipline was always there, but I'm going to, you know, discipline towards yoga is, uh, is going to, you know, give me uh, a long walk, a long healthy walk in life. So I wanted to add one more thing, very important one. We had uh, during this yoga, I really wish to share that I lost five kilos of weight which is again a good experience because of exercise. It's all because of yoga that this has happened. You know, uh, thank you so much for this, uh, Edward. Um, it is really motivating to hear that not only, you know, while I think um, yoga was running in your family with your wife practicing for over a decade now, you were seeing her, uh, but there is always a, a mind that you have to make up to start something and so in your example after 10 years you decided to do so where while you were seeing your wife um, uh, you know practicing yoga uh, yes you need a mind to start and once you start i think i like what you spoke about consistency and discipline and if you follow i think 
results definitely follow especially from a lifestyle transformation thank you so much edward and i'm sure your words of wisdom uh, is going to be extremely motivating to my viewers at digital wellness and there are a lot of takeaways from this right from um, how you start how you actually manage and how do you actually have a mind to actually take it forward uh, in your day to day life and it is all seen that it not only increases your uh, productivity for your day to day activities because we just heard edward speaking about how he has changed as a person it has made him much calm, calmer and he also mentioned that he was a foodie but without altering taste you can definitely make uh, changes to your diet and as a part of the entire lifestyle transformation diet and yoga asanas play a very important role so keep watching for more episodes on yoga and yoga benefits do like subscribe to my channel digital wellness thank you once again for watching digital wellness